Cape Bay State running here with Amelia Everett of Newton South. Third place in the 800 here today, 208.37. Uh, season best, actually an indoor best too, right? Mm -hmm. um, Amelia, uh, talk about this race match and what you did in the outdoor, getting third there yeah. too. Um, but uh, uh, tell us about this race, 62 for your opening quarter. Um, yeah, I was really excited. It's such a fun environment and kind of like got to know all the girls and like events New Balance organized before this. So I was just really excited to run fast with a lot of awesome people. So Amelia, tell us about this event um, right before you guys are going to run. They turn off the lights, they have all this fireworks and everything. Uh, what does that do for you? Does it hype you up or does it get you even more nervous? Um, well, I was expecting it a little bit, so it didn't, it didn't make me more nervous. I think kind of with the music, they chose a good song, so I think that really helped kind of get into the zone be like, this is happening, this is fun, like this isn't stressful, like this is going to be fun. Which was, it was good. So how did you feel throughout this race? So like I said, opening with a 62 and then getting mixed up in that crowd and, and being able to get yourself through and get third. Yeah, um, I think kind of almost similar to last week and it's kind of having other people in the race. It's, you can find a gear like I wouldn't really find in a DCL meet because there's no one to try to catch. Um, and I think the goal is just to kind of stay relaxed through the first half and then work up the second half if I needed to which I was able to do, um, and just kind of run a controlled, relaxed, but fast race. And Amelia, earlier in the season when you were going through everything that you were going through, did you ever think, you know, it would come to this where you, you would get All-American again here at the 800? Were you getting nervous that, that it might not happen? Um, I was trying not to think about it. Um, I think it's definitely like so surreal every time it happens. Um, and I was just kind of trying to focus on the present and keep training, keep getting my numbers up, and here we are. And I know you're scheduled for the mile tomorrow. I heard you uh, talking to Coach Steve McChesney that maybe, maybe not. Yeah. So you, what are you thinking? What are you thinking? Um, I mean, I would love to. It's kind of nothing to lose, so might as well do it. But also at the same time, I've had two good races this weekend, so I might just want to end it on a high note and go cheer on everyone else who's running. So we'll see. We'll see where the night takes us. <laughs> yeah, and the other race you're talking about is the sprint medley, right? Yesterday yeah. running, yeah. Uh, I think, a 211 two anchor. Which was the fastest, I think, of all the anchors yesterday. Did how did you feel there? Did did that kind of give you confidence coming here, knowing how you felt there? Yeah, definitely. I would say I actually felt like more tired and kind of tense yesterday. I think just because it was kind of a different atmosphere with the relay and everything. Um, but it definitely gave me confidence. Like I can recover and like run even faster in the 800. I could, I knew I had something left. Well, Amelia, congratulations. A great Thank job you. today. A Thank great you. job the rest of the season, too. Thank so, uh, congrats again. Thank you.